G'day, Marvel Future Fight Gamers. Vader G. Looks like we've got a bit of a uh, sneak peek here. Multiverse of Madness. Let's just click on it. Uh, have a bit of a look at the video. Break it down. Alright. Alright. Pretty cool. Multiverse of Madness update. Uh, kind of bummed that there's no mention of Green Goblin Tier 3. Um, but, you know, we'll deal with that as it comes. The, the update does, it looks pretty cool. It looks like, you know, it kind of looks like we could be in for some uh, interesting character upgrades. Uh, Scarlet Witch, um, already very close to the power curve uh, in female, uh, so universal female uh, hero. Um, going to be very interesting with her new uniform to see if she actually retains uh, the, the universal tag. Uh, if she retains the actual hero tag as well. Um, you know, I believe that, you know, we could be looking at a bit of a zombie wander. A few different things could be happening uh, in the multiverse of Madness. So going to be very interesting. Uh, I would like to see a rework of her tier 3 skill. Her tier 3 skill is pretty damn weak. Um, if she just gets that little bump, then, you know, and she stays universal and she stays hero, look out, uh, Fina. Uh, if she moves to evil, then, you know, there's lots of, lots of possibilities with Wanda. Um, she should be up there, though. She is, you know, probably the most powerful female, um, you know, alongside Captain Marvel in, in the Marvel cinema, Cinematic Universe. So, Doctor Strange, obviously, uh, the movie is based around Strange and his actions. Um, will be very interesting to see if he returns to the matter. He's been in and out a number of times. He's been in and out not just of uh, Alliance Battle Extreme or PvP matter, uh, PvE matter, but he's also been in the PvP matter um, on and off over the years many times. So definitely dropped off the power curve, definitely needs an upgrade, going to be very interesting to see. The third character in that sneak peek, America Chavez, which kind of blows my mind. Um, I didn't even buy her most recent uniform, but her most, use of re uh, most recent uniform, right? Um, this was only a couple of months ago. I'm pretty sure that this dropped. So, very, very interesting. Uh, probably a bit of a bit of a bummer if you're a collector, because I think you're going to have to try and get another uniform uh, for her. Uh, be interesting to see if she goes anywhere near the power curve or, or, the, or the sort of meta curve. At this point in time, she's not, and that's why I've got her level 60 and, and built like garbage. Um, kind of the odd one out in that sneak peek for me, but then again, I don't know a huge amount about the actual movie. Uh, who we don't, who we didn't see anything of, if we didn't see anything about uh, Charles Xavier, we didn't see him, although we know he's coming in the movie, so it'll be interesting to see if he gets released in, or he gets mentioned in future sneak peeks. Uh, Baron Mordo, once again, we didn't see anything uh, in terms of a new uniform, but I'm pretty confident that we can expect a new uniform for Mordo uh, in its update coming up. And of course, the fan favorite Wong, um, who is a really cool actor, that guy. I, I really do like the, the, the fellow who plays Wong. He plays that, that part super well. Um, and hopefully it gets a really cool uniform that makes him useful in one of the game modes. Um, because at the moment, I mean, the best thing about Wong currently is probably his leadership, where he does the uh, immune to physical attacks, and and that's probably the best thing about him at, at this stage. So, definitely interested in seeing if these three come in a future sneak peek. Uh, but at this point in time, these three, you know, looking pretty good. Um, be interesting to see the uniform changes. Strange always been very powerful. Whenever they've reworked him, they've always made him very powerful. But he's in a he's in a blast hero. Um, category and that category is pretty well overcooked in terms of talent um, and, and it kind of makes me wonder with the universal theme of this multiverse of madness um, if they might even throw him a universal uniform and if so he could become a contender for uh, universal hero and does he actually stay hero who knows? So many different possibilities. But yeah, interesting sneak peek. Uh, while I'm here, we've got the uh, Odin's Blessing Combine event on. So, just going to quickly do some combines. I think I've got, you know, probably a couple of hundred euro to combine. Six star. Um, so, I'll just do 178. We're looking for double physical attack. That's what I want, double physical attack. So, let's just see if we can 
Let's just see if we can actually get one of these. I have been going, so 89 combines have been going pretty bad with this event this last couple of times this is, that this has been on. I've got some Odin's Blessings, but they haven't really been the double attack type. Um, so let's see. And no double attack. Actually, quite a few Odin's Blessings there, though. So what do we got? We got uh, six, seven Odin's Blessings, which is probably a pretty decent ratio. Um, let's see if we can get any more. Got 40, 40 odd combines to do here. Yeah, got a. Got, so we, we're up to sort of. Um, what are we up to? So that's nine Odin's Blessings. So actually, the ratio is good. Just the type of Odin, Odin's Blessing. Yeah, yeah, bingo, bingo. Not, I really want a physical, but that that's cool. I'm happy with them. Happy with that magic one. So that's pretty neat. Um, and we're actually going pretty well. That's like like ten Odin's Blessings, right? So. That's pretty solid. I don't expect to get any more from these crumbs, but if you do, it's always a bonus if that happens, but it's not going to happen today by the looks of it. Um, so we'll just be very happy with what we've got and, and move on. So um, yeah, pretty cool. Guys, let me know what you think about the... Um, let me know what you think about this uh, Multiverse of Madness update. Uh, no doubt these three characters... I don't know about America Chavez. I've never really mucked around with her much, but Strange definitely needs an upgrade. Scarlet Witch always, you know, pretty close to the meta curve already. Um, will she keep her universal tag? Will she stay a hero? You guys, I'd be interested to know what your thoughts are. She's a pretty hot piece of work, old Wanda, isn't she? Be very interested to know what your thoughts are. And um, yeah, let me know. Let me know in the comments below. Hit me up. Thanks, guys.